definitely the coolest thing I've ever done as a machinist. Especially being able to operate one of these machines is a, is a huge opportunity for me. We send, we send the code over to the machine, the Haas. The Haas reads the code. From there, it's a matter of just letting the machine know where we want to print. So we'll use uh, the probe. It's just like this little bitty, I don't know, two and a half inch long with a ruby like tip ball on the end of it. And that's what we use to find the part. Once that's uh, been determined, we just hit cycle start. The weld head deploys and it just starts laying these nice pretty little those stainless steel beads. So we don't need the material, we create the material, then we subtract it. We use certain tools, mills, drills, and machine away the rough surface, the weld, to get that nice, pretty uh, stainless steel finish. To so take that part out of the machine for the last time, blow off the coolant, blow away the chips, and see the final product is, is always very, very rewarding. Just recently we created the sprayer plate for the number six D-bag and it's, it's designed to disperse uh, lubricating and cooling oil on the helical gears as well as the bearings behind the helical gears. And it was all fully manufactured on the ship. Now that we have all six D-bags up, we can efficiently operate our deballasting system and get our, get our well deck from eight to ten feet down to zero feet at the sill and a good time, I'll we'll just say that. Your measurements are right, everything lines up, and a nice, beautiful machine product is what every machinist strives for.